out a four-phase vaccination distribution plan. Our Atlanta Bureau Chief, Archith Shashadri, explains who will get priority in the coming months. The shot that could change the pandemic. Because there's no actual virus involved, you don't get the kind of damage you get with a COVID-19 infection where the virus can attack your lungs, your other organs, your tissues. Doctors say after healthcare workers, first responders and seniors would be next in line for the vaccine. While some of the vaccine symptoms can mimic COVID symptoms, they don't include respiratory symptoms. So people who've been vaccinated shouldn't have side effects like cough and congestion and shortness of breath. Health experts say it will take several months before the general population can get vaccinated, possibly late next year. The message that I hope that we're able to deliver to our community is that your time will come soon. We are anticipating that by the end of next year, um, that there will be enough vaccine uh, to go around for everyone who wishes to receive it. Doctors say you'll need two doses of the vaccine, but the side effects are minimal. There are certainly people who have side effects, things like a sore arm, fatigue, muscle aches, potentially even fevers and chills. But two important things to know, one is that while those side effects can look like COVID symptoms, they do not mean you are contagious or that you can that you have COVID or that you can give COVID to anyone. Those are just your immune system reacting to the vaccine. It's actually a good thing. It means you're having a response. Doctors say seven out of 10 people will need to get the vaccine to achieve herd immunity. Reporting in Atlanta, Archit Sashadri, Atlanta Bureau Chief.